And good morning, Houston. We're here live in Sugarland. Oh, yeah. We're talking robots, robots, and even more robots getting a hands-on experience right here at Techno Chaos. Oh, you don't want to miss it. It's also oh, super cool, super cool. All this and more when we come on back. Come on. In Houston, we're going on a little high tech as we take you to Robot Central. Oh, yeah, you don't want to miss this all this tomorrow when we come on back. Come, come on back. back. Well, new technology is making robots a lot more human like. Yeah, it sure are. Uh, take, for example, Honda's latest robot that can pour a drink. Ah. Here in Houston, one robotics camp is hoping to get kids to embrace technology and make the next big thing. And Ruben is there at Sugarland at Techno Chaos. Hey, buddy. I love that name. Hey, guys. Good morning. You know, I am so excited about it because I've never seen anything like it ever in my life. Meet Hercules the robot here at Techno Chaos. And these kids are having a great old time. Come on, kids. Do your thing. Do your thing. Robots everywhere. It's the perfect place to be this summer. But we're talking high tech. It's not just all fun and games. Here. I mean, these kids are pretty smart and they are serious about their work and their craft. So let's introduce you to the vice president here, the co owner, Mike. How you doing, buddy? Hey, good morning. Well, I've never seen anything like it because you are really getting hands on. So describe the nuts and bolts when it comes to learning everything about robots here. Yeah, and uh, we start from basics. As you can see, we start with Lego bricks. We've got a ton of them here and we work on up from there. We, uh, we start with age appropriate hands on activities. So we start students at wh what they can master and keep it growing. So you can start around age five or six here and go all the way to age 18. And if you never go beyond 18, that's okay too. I, I'm still around that age right now. I like that. <laughs> all right. And then what do you have here? I have a Vex IQ robot. It's um, made with mainly Lego parts. And Lego you built this yourself? Um, no, I did not. <laughs> Unfortunately, I helped build this robot Oh, even here. bigger and better. <laughs> okay. This is mainly for the middle school level okay. and elementary. Um, this is more high school. Okay, look, you are showing off now. Can I have a high five? I like her. Let's come on over here, Houston, because let's take a look at some of the bigger robots. Now, what is your name? Hi, I'm Alan Gregory. Okay, and what is this? This is a first robotics competition robot. So this is the varsity level of robotics. This is high school students are able to build this alongside engineers. So okay. You have engineers from engineering companies working and mentoring high school students directly. Okay. So after they come well with all the Lego robots, they work their way up and they work with something like this. All right, good stuff. Go all right, guys, are y'all ready to rumble in a little bit? All right, so you don't want to miss it. So we're going to have a little robotic competition rumble going on. So back to you in the station. And by the way, my favorite robot, the Jetsons. Remember, I want that maid to come over to my house and clean my house Rosie. today. <laughs> Rosie. Rosie. Awesome. Maybe they can build you that over there. Ask them. Yeah, I want Rosie. But yeah, that's her everything. name, Rosie. They would say, hey, Mr. G. <laughs> <laughs> Who said that? that is come on now, come on. Now. <laughs> that was fabulous. You know who that was. All right, Rube, we'll see you for the rumble a little bit later. Bye, guys. Yeah, I like that. The robot Rosie rumble. Oh, yeah, that would come in handy. <laughs> and good morning, Houston. It's time to rumble. That's right, robotic style. Oh, you don't want to miss this. All this tomorrow when we come on back. Come on back. Come on back. Well, meanwhile, kids these days are just a lot more technologically advanced than we were, I think, at that age. Yeah, safe to say. And now many of them are making robots and then putting them in a competition. So this morning, we've got Ruben live in Sugarland at a robotics camp to tell us all about it. Hey, buddy. Hey, guys. Yeah, you know what? I'm telling you, this is a place to be this summer. If you want to get a little high tech and have some fun with our robots, in fact, we are rumbling right now. This is a really cool competition. It's called... Oh. This is with our soft robots. Soft robots. Yes, yes. And uh, we also have robot rumbles with, like, First Lego League and some of the other battle bots, like they're here and right in front of you. Okay. Um, well, this is our friend. And she's a president. Her name is Jeanette here at Techno Chaos. And take a look for yourself. I mean, we're talking serious robots here now. We have some photos that we want to show our viewers right now. What kind of robots do y'all build here? Uh, we build a wide range, all starting off at age seven with your early robotics. We go all the way to first Lego League, which is using the NXTs. We also have the VEX robotics and VEX IQ. And then even for adults and for uh, some of the children, we have the battle bots and sumo bots that are going on. This is pretty serious. All right, all right. So let's go ahead and highlight some of the uh, other robots that some of our students have made here. In fact, they have cams here. And uh, what is your name? Turn around. Peyton. Peyton, all right, pick up your other robot because I want to I highlight this. We have to have this at KPRC 
for all of our employees because this is really cool. Now, what, what do you what do you do with this? Can you pick it up real quick? Oh yes. All right. We'll get to back to you in a second. All right. All right. <laughs> this is Mike. Now, Mike, understand that Creeper is very popular. Is that right? Yeah, it is. It's one of the most popular figures out of the Minecraft game, uh -huh. which all the young kids know about. So, how does it work? Show me. Uh, well, it, this is a full remote control robot. Uh, we built it to show what, what imagination and creativity along with technical capabilities uh -huh. can do. So we're, we're trying to inspire both kids and adults to be innovative. So we uh, we have run this in the Houston Art Car Parade. Okay. We've got it at Comic Palooza several times. Ooh, all we right. have a lot of fun with this. Sounds good. All right. So, buddy, are you ready to go on? All right. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. This is live television. All righty, buddy. Go ahead. Well, now, what you have My, here? Uh, this is a plotter. Okay. I have it saying Techno Chaos right now. And What does it do? Well, it plots points on the program. Oh, so it's not, it's not like a receipt? It, it uses doesn't print out receipts? Pretty much, but instead of printing out receipts, it prints out Techno Chaos. Oh, see, so. that's, that's where we're different. Okay, so Rachel and Owen, take a look for yourself. This kid is like so much like smarter, like up here. I'm like just barely getting it. <laughs> anyway, thank you, buddy. I appreciate it. Can I have a high five or a shake? Like, All right. Ruben's hey guys, like, anyway, what is this? A script printer yeah, or right? what? <laughs> That's I'm, I'm like, what the heck is this? I'm like, kiddo. I'm like, I mean, give me a break here. Like, this guy is, like, all intense. All I want to do is this. I just want to show it and look at it. This is, like, an old-school printer that you would see at uh, Luby's right. Cafeteria. And they were like, here's your receipt. Thank you so much. $5.99. Go on your with your way. <laughs> That's funny. Buddy, I'm not trying to get all complicated here. All right, hey, guys. Like, anyway, like, Techno Chaos, a great place. Come on down. They have camps. And, uh, hey, yeah. have some fun with all the kids. It's Back so to you in the fun. Station. I love it. And I love the girls in there, too. Too, learning their math That's and right. science. That's a good sight to Get see. Get your innovation on. Oh, and by the way, uh, she is a, a, a chemical engineer. Ooh. Yes, uh, Jeanette, so very smart here. <laughs> Don't rub her too much, man. Oh, she can make you disappear uh, with those robots. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, doll. We appreciate one. it. Very cool. Very cool. All right.